Hello everyone, welcome to our video. Here we are demonstrating our project which is vehicle dashboard using Canon IoT. In this project we are using two microcontrollers namely STM32 and ESP32. And uh, here you can see that we are using sen different sensor. The first one you can see here HC89 speed sensor used for RPM measurement and motor speed feedback. And LM35 which gives the engine temperature we can see on the board and in front you can see that the ultra sonic sensor which is SCSR04 used for obstacle detection CAN transceiver and controller enables communication between two microcontroller uh, over the CAN protocol and ESP32 collects the data from sensor like GPS, humidity, air quality and it updates all the sensor data to the OLED display and you can here see that the jerk sensor which is also connected to the STM uh, STM32 boards and all these data will send to the cloud which you can see on a cloud dashboard right now now you can see that the hcsr4 which is ultrasonic sensor measuring the distance using the ultrasonic waves and all the distance was updated uh, real time in the cloud dashboard now we have mpo6050 jerk sensor initially it was uh, showing no jerk detected but as soon as we moved the sensor a jerk detection message was shown on our dashboard it calculate on the basis of orientation acceleration and angular velocity and also we have a gps uh, neo 6m module which gives the real time location of our system and uh, we have dst11 which gives the temperature and uh, humidity value and also the air quality sensor mq135 which detects gases like uh, co2 and s3 smoke it is used in air quality monitoring and pollution detection. Now you can see all these values are updated on our cloud dashboard. Now we are going to demonstrate the speed sensor. It detects the object interruption using a slot type optical coupler. It gives the out output digital signal when an object passes through the slot. As you can see the values in the dashboard is updated and we get the speed value here. We get all the values real time on dashboard. And now let's summarize with the help of a circuit diagram. You, uh, now you can see that on your left, you can see that the STM32 microcontroller, it is connected to all the sensor like LM32, distance and speed. These sensors send their reading to STM32, which processes them, STM processes them, and the process data is sent by the CAN bus to the ESP32. This is the same protocol which is used in real cars and fast reliable communication. ESP32 collects the data from sensors like uh, GPS, humidity, and air quality, and it updates all the sensor data to the OLED display with the graphical causes and local monitoring. For local monitoring, it sends the same data to the cloud platform also. Once it's on the cloud mm, platform, we can uh, monitor all the parameters on a live uh, on a smartphone on any other devices from anywhere any place making the dashboard both for local and remote so this is uh, all about our video if you like the video make sure you hit the like button and for any doubts uh, you can ask in comment section thank you